history was made in Las Vegas this past weekend when gymnasts from Fisk University chalked up to become part of the first historically black college university team to compete in an NCAA women's gymnastics event. It was a mere 14 months ago when Fisk University committed to building a collegiate gymnastics program right from the ground up. And in a sport where the number of black gymnasts are increasing part, part, in large part due to Olympic giants like Gabby Douglas and Simone Biles, this groundbreaking team is really something special. And so I want to bring in Fisk University Gymnastics team member Jordan Cromarty and Fisk University Gymnastics head coach or head coach, athletic director Corrine Tarver. Thanks both for being here. Congratulations. What, what a day. I'm really glad we're doing this story. Jordan, I understand you had a big hand in making this happen. How did, how did it go? How did that go down? A conversation with your aunt and uncle? Is that what I understand? Um, yes, sir. Um, Thanksgiving last year, my uncle kind of sat me down at the table and was basically just like, so where are you going to school? And um, he is a Fisk alum, so he was kind of just like, you should come to Fisk, you should come to Fisk. And I was just like, I've spent my whole life trying to make it on a collegiate gymnastics team. So I wouldn't come to Fisk unless they had a program or something for me to do. Um, but I was looking at so many other schools. And during that conversation, he was just like, OK, like, watch me make it happen. And um, a couple months later, it ended up happening. Yeah. It's great. But. It is. Uh, uh, it's fantastic uh, and and a real landmark. Although, uh, uh, Corinne, I wanted to ask you, if if I may, you have a a background. Obviously, one of the first uh, gymnasts, uh, black gymnasts, to compete and succeed at this level. And you know, I must say, you know, Fisk, a great old American institution of higher learning. I'm surprised it took till now. So, uh, what does it mean to be coaching this team uh, at this uh moment? It's actually pretty uh, exciting, but it's also a long time coming. And as you said, it's something that uh, I think a lot of people, it's one of those, really, there, there's not a team at an HBCU? Oh, and just people kind of thought that it was already there. So it is a long time coming, something that should have happened a long time ago. However, it's here now, so that's what's most important. And and Jordan, yeah, how's, how's it feel being part of this team? Or for, well, what are your events? And, and this, this debut meet in Las Vegas. And, and what do you think makes the team so important? How are you guys doing on us? Um, I feel like being part of the team, it's still really surreal. I feel like I still don't know how much of an impact like we're making on the world. I kind of just still feel like I'm part of like a collegiate team, which is crazy, but it's going to be really fun in the future to see like what happens. Um, my events are... For this year, I'm pretty fo much focusing on floor and beam. I had surgery last April, so I'm not 100% cleared yet to do all four. For sure. Well, uh, Corrine, what's the goal here? You know, I mean, this is uh, a groundbreaking event. It, it, as you said, a long time coming. What's your goal for your team? Well, honestly, I want the team to go out there every single competition, do the best that they're capable of doing, do their job. I, and walk away feeling like they put everything out there. They left everything on the mat, as they say. And as far as overall, I'm hoping that we are a blueprint for other HBCUs to add a gymnastics program. All right. Well, it is. It's a great day for gymnastics, for Fisk, for the country, and good luck to to you guys, to your team. By the way, what Fisk University? What? What's your mascot? What's the team name? Um, we're the Bulldogs. We're Bulldogs. All right, well, go. Go Bulldogs, right? <laughs> Thank, yes. Thanks very much, Jordan Cromartie. Good luck to you, Corinne Tarver. Good luck Thank to you. all of you. Thanks very much. Thank, Thank you. you. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.